a tip. Lower it. Lower it. Yep. Yep. Keep it right in there. Steer them that way if you can, because we've got another rod over here. A little pressure. Yep. Yep. Perfect. Perfect. That's what, exactly what you've got to do, because we're only fishing with six-pound test line. Uh huh. That's what I use. So you gotta when they want to go, you gotta let them go. I don't like fishing with close line. He's down a bit. Yeah, just gonna tire him out. Be patient. Tire him out. See this back here, Regina? I can't see through there, so. Oh. Get to where you can see. You don't have to drive anymore because the, the motor's off. You just said I was mad. <laughs> <laughs> One could assume that from what she said, you know what? My nickname's not Zipper, is it? <laughs> Low your rod tip as you reel to try to keep him away from these motors. He wants to go run under the motors for whatever reason. He wants to just hang down. Yep, just, just let him stay, just like that. He's just getting tired. Pull that rod out of the way for me. No, that, not that one, Regina. This one here. So we don't step on it if we got to move around any. Easy on the pressure. Don't put too much on him. Just hold him. Really swimming. He's just he's just he's just staying down there. He doesn't want to come up into that warm water. That's what he doesn't like. Is the warm water up near the surface. He doesn't want to run either. He's just hanging. Just hanging there. That's Big fish do that. When he gets tired. How we lose fish using these fly rods because people get impatient with them. Oh yeah. We put too much pressure on them and we'll break them off. That's why I have to just keep reminding you all the time because the tendency is, and the, and the thing you got to remember, Joe, is if he decides to go, which he may do, is he gets up closer to the boat, take a hand right off that reel and let him go. <clears throat> just let him go as far as he wants to go. Be up to 10 or 15 minutes. Yeah. Had one the other day. It took us over 15 minutes to get in. Good size one. Yep. Yeah. No. 
Like just it. keep reeling a little bit. Oh, yeah, I got pressure on him. He's not going anywhere. Yeah. Regina, hold this for me. Okay, I'm going to go right around you. Yep. Yep. I'm not that fat. It's not according to Regina. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm still around the line. I can't see it. That friggin' monofilament, I can't see it. No, I can't either. I don't know which way he's going. Is there a fish on your pole too? Nope. <sighs> Go ahead, reel in. Reel it in? Reel it in, yeah. Stop, because I'm wound right around your line. There he is out there. Regina, I'm gonna have you just hold that rod. Just hold it, okay? Okay, wind down, Joe. Wind down. Let him in. Yep, back in. Yep. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Son of a bitch. I gotta see which way that's where it wrapped. I'm gonna bring it over your way? Nope. Sir. He's out. He's out. Just hold on to that. Okay, you're all set now. That's a nice fish. Remember, if he wants to go, let him go. Okay, raise your rod tip. Ah, that wasn't nearly what the fish I thought it was. <laughs> no. He was wrapped around that that yeah. other line. Yeah, still it's a nice looking fish. Yeah. Okay, give me some line right off the reel. I thought that was a big fish. 